Well, on Sunday, thousands of students will graduate from NKU, but one of those students will be given his degree from his own wife. Ashley tells us how this is just part of a really unique story. Yeah, it is. So Wesley Brown will get a degree in photography with a minor from his wife. She is the interim president at NKU. Now his four year degree as a non traditional student is just part of this story of resiliency and determination. I say he's like the uncle of the students. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess, you know, you could say that. Bonita Brown jokes about her husband, Wesley Brown, who is a non-traditional student at NKU. She's the interim president. Wesley is about to graduate with a bachelor's degree Sunday. Wesley majored in photography with a minor in entrepreneurial studies. I took it more seriously after my uh, first wife passed, and that was just a way to kind of deal with the grief. Um, I dealt with my grief through telling other people's story. These are some of the photos he has taken through the years here at NKU. Of course, this is a image of a widow receiving the flag from one of the servicemen. The projects he's most proud of were working with a funeral home during the pandemic and telling the stories about truck drivers through photos. It was a way for me to utilize my pain through different things in life. Um, I was also there uh, speaking with Mr. Battle and he was able to open himself up to me as well as I opened myself to him. When Wesley enrolled in the fall of 2019, he had no clue his own wife would award him his degree. I had no clue I was going to be invited to be the interim president. Uh, I think even as I, the board was talking to me about that, uh, not a chapter I said yes, did I think about the fact that he was graduating. And I was like, oh my goodness, my name is going to be on his degree. I actually get to hand it to him. You couldn't have scripted this any better. Bonita says she helped her husband as much as she could. He excelled in the photography courses, but some of his general studies created obstacles. The writing and the math, I think he struggled the most with those. I couldn't help him with the math, uh, so I was able to connect him with the tutors here on campus. She says not only is it never too late to get a degree, Wesley is 44 years old, by the way, but for anyone that has tough times, Wesley is an example of resiliency. Uh, he had many obstacles, as you mentioned. There are some days he was frustrated. Uh, there are some days I had to talk him through and say, okay, you can do this. We, you can get through this. You know, just think about this. Um, and just resilience. He was determined to get it. He was not going to give up. The entire family will be in town Sunday to see this couple on their big day. Yes. Who's taking the pictures? That's a good question. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he usually takes the photos. Uh, yeah. So we don't know. Somebody will take photos. Yeah. Who's going to take the photos? <laughs> you know, That's to good. put this into perspective, just last year, Wesley's son graduated with his own college degree, and at times the two would compete for best GPA, who would finish school first. But Wesley says that his son ultimately won because he then enlisted in the service. Now, graduation at NKU is Sunday, beginning at 1030 in the morning. And by the way, he's just going to pursue, uh, he already has a uh, photography business, mm -hmm. and he's just going to continue to grow that. What, is this photography business like include like selling cameras or just taking photos? Just taking photos. So he, he specializes in event photography like graduation. <laughs> he says he does not do weddings, but he will do anything else. Huh. Doesn't like weddings. Weddings are, he yeah. says, you only get one chance to yeah. capture the moment. Oh, I you bet, can't yeah. You recreate it. And it's just, a, it's a long day. It's a lot of pressure. So he leaves that to other people. This stuff's good. The, these two projects, really the good. funeral home one and then this one with truck yeah. drivers, were great because since he's 44 years old, he actually had a career in the funeral business and in the trucking business in a past life. So How about that? He said, you know, he used that in his new career to kind of tell the story. That's good so, stuff. Yeah. Congratulations to him and to all the graduates, but to have your wife actually present you with that degree, is that's going to be so special. That's sweet. Yeah.